Julian Brock's past season with Louisiana was one of elevation, and it caught the attention of the Texas Rangers, where the junior catcher was drafted as the 231st overall pick. Our Seth Lewis exclusively spoke with Brock, who says this is a dream come true. Take me through the moment that you got the call from the Rangers. Uh, it was it was exciting at first. Uh, you know, uh, a lot was going through my mind just throughout the whole day, and uh, to finally hear my name called, man, it was it was pretty surreal. I got to enjoy it with my family, so it was it was awesome. It was awesome to experience with them. What was the conversation like? And then, yeah, like what did they kind of communicate with you as far as like their expectations? Uh, they, yeah, they're just excited to, uh, that they're able to, to to draft me. You know, um, I talked to a few guys um, from director of ops to farm director to kind of uh just director of scouting and whatnot but um i was they were all just very excited you know um for me to get in there you know get going for rangers fans that obviously don't know you or don't know your game like what would you tell them they're getting they're, they're getting a guy that works hard a guy that just loves the grind guy that just wants to do it every day as long as he can you know a guy that's gonna go out there, play as hard as he can. I said it's the only way I've learned it. It's the only way I've been taught it. So, a guy that's gonna play hard, you know, until the, until that until that twenty seventh out's called. Obviously, you were one of three guys for the Cajuns that was selected in the draft. Uh, can you just speak to obviously Jackson and Carson going? Carson getting picked in the in the second round and just maybe how that is part of a reflection of the success that you as a team have been able to have it's definitely a, a mirror image of what we have as, as ball club you know i'm excited to see where rocco ends up and how his pro ball career ends up getting started same with nez you know uh, i'm so excited for those guys i mean it was it was all a matter of time before they were gonna hear their names called and i'm so happy that rocco got called day one early that day man that was awesome and then uh me, of course, and seeing Nez, Nez's name get called, that was pretty surreal. Um, I think that's just kind of a small stepping stone of what this program can be able to do every year, you know? Um, this program produces pro athletes every year, and um, I'm so excited to see what the next year comes, who, who's the next occasion to get their name called, you know? I'm excited for this program.